so I have the Samsung Galaxy A54 5G and in today's tech tip I'll be showing you what to do in case you forgot your password pin or pattern and you're basically locked out of your own phone you can't go past the lock screen because you can't remember the password pin or pattern and even the fingerprint doesn't seem to work okay so basically you can't get into the phone the only solution the only way around this is to perform a hard reset now a hard reset will wipe away all the user data including your password pin and pattern now the only caveat to this is you'll still need the google account on the phone when you're setting up the phone afresh so after the factory data reset which is a hard reset you're going to set up the phone afresh but during that setup process you're going to need your google account the one that's already on the phone so you'll have to sign in to that google account just to verify that you're the owner of this phone okay so um to perform a hard reset you're gonna have to go into recovery mode and to do that get your data cable and connect this cable to the phone connect your data cable to the phone and the other end of that data cable connect it to a computer now it could be a windows computer could be a mac could be a linux computer could be a desktop a laptop it doesn't really matter as long as it's a computer and then once you do that you're now ready to go for the uh recovery mode so to get this phone into recovery mode we basically have to force a shutdown and then soon after the shutdown uh restart the phone in recovery mode okay so normally putting the phone in recovery mode is easy when the phone is off all you have to do is press and hold the side key or the power button plus volume up and the, then when the samsung logo appears release the power button and that gets you into recovery mode but since the phone is on already we have to force a shutdown and then quickly move to uh, starting it in recovery mode so the best way to do this and the best way to time this is with the screen on okay so if your screen is off just press it and make sure the screen is on and then press and hold side button plus volume down and then ignore the power menu just keep holding screen goes off switch to uh, volume up immediately samsung logo appears release the power button and that should put us in recovery mode okay so it's very simple so now that you are inside recovery mode you need to just perform a hard factory reset so use the volume brokers to scroll down and go all the way to wipe data slash factory reset and then use the power button to select and then confirm by scrolling down and selecting factory data reset using the side key so press that and that's going to start the uh, data wipe it's going to wipe all the data and as soon as you see data wipe complete it means all the data has been removed from the phone so what you need to do now is go ahead and uh, reboot the system now so make sure reboot system now is selected and then use the side key to select again so that so now it's going to reboot this the phone and it should reboot the phone now back to the initial startup screen okay since we have no data on the phone it should reboot to the startup screen where you can now start setting up the phone fresh so once the phone restarts it's going to take us to the welcome screen so let's quickly set this phone up okay so you have to agree to those uh end user license agreement and then it's going to ask us to set up using another device i'll tap on skip now it says clearly here that an unauthorized attempt has been made to reset your device to factory's default settings connect to a wi-fi or mobile network to verify your identity so basically you have to connect to the internet because we have to sign in to a google account so connect to a wi-fi network quickly and after the connection tap on next so the next page you'll see is telling us to confirm the pattern now remember this is a pattern we forgot so we don't we can't remember it but there's an option here to use my google account instead so tap on that and it's going to go 
into the phone and check the Google account that was initially on the phone and ask you to sign into that same Google account to verify. So here we go. So go ahead and uh, sign into that Google account. Start with the Gmail address. And then tap on next. Enter the password. And then hit next again. And if you need to verify, do that. So we've currently verified ourselves by signing into the Google account. And now it's going to ask us if you want to use another different account or add previous account, basically continuing with the account we had on the phone earlier. So I'll just choose that to add previous account to continue with the old Google account. And then it's going to allow you to continue with the setup process. So if you want to copy apps and data, from a previous one, you can do that, but I'll choose don't copy. Account added, tap on next. I don't want to restore any backup, so I'll tap on that. Google services, you have to read and accept. And then, as you can see, it gives you the option to now set up a new face unlock, fingerprint, pin, password, or pattern, okay? So you can set all those up, or you can skip and do that later. There you go, there is a Google Assistant. I'll skip that for now. Skip. And then I'll deselect all this for now and tap OK. I'm just doing the normal setup process. It's nothing complicated here. Samsung services, you have to go ahead and agree. I'll choose light mode and I'm all set up. Choose later, exit app setup, yes. And as you can see, we are now back into our phone, okay? And that's basically how to bypass a forgotten password pin or pattern on your Samsung Galaxy A54 5G. Thanks for watching. Leave your comments and questions down below and good luck.